Hello, welcome back. All right, so this message is for the feminine collective, all zodiac signs. Whoever resonates with the feminine energy, I will just see whatever messages I can pick up on. This is a general reading, so take what resonates. If you would like to book a personal reading with me or one of my other services, link to my website is in the description box below. Okay. Very first thing that I was picking up on, I want to caution you, feminine, regardless of what you think about it, beware of the, there's a masculine energy here that they're cautioned, they're, they're, I'm, this individual is a karmic person in your life, they're t and they're older than you. Or there's something very mature about their energy, it appears that way. I feel as if they, they will be trying to offer you some sort of stability. This person may offer you money or things or just because what I was hearing was be careful of the man with the sweet words and or the pretty face or the something about it's like I feel as if this masculine is going to try to specifically for some of you it may be money but it's almost like they appear very stable and I feel that they are but there's something about this that If you get too caught up with this person, whoever whoever this is, you will feel extremely burdened because they're involved in a lot of things that, that you may not realize. Um, or there's a lot more than meets the eye to these sweet gifts or whatever's going on. They may want to take you on a trip or somewhere Yeah, so just use caution with this person. They're gonna try to impress you. I just keep repeating the same thing because I just want you guys to understand, you know, what, however this, however, but, but you need to be careful with this person. They will bring you burden. They've got a lot of baggage. It will, it will be very karmic or it is. For those of you, um, Yeah, mm -mm. and I see I see you inevitably like leaving it behind anyway. And again, this could be a personal relationship or some sort of business deal or something where where the like slogan, the main thing to like hook you in is stability or money or flashy things. That's that's it's a little bit of a trick. It's a little bit of a trick. Not necessarily intentionally. This individual just isn't really what they say they are. And you will find that out if you have not already. Okay. For the feminine energy, I am also seeing money improving as well. Mm -hmm. There's also potential money coming from some sort of open form connection that you have. This is like a casual connection. I don't feel as if you're, you know, it's not like a job or something that you're totally committed and involved with. There's some sort of opportunity here with that coming in the next three weeks or three months. Feminines, you will be choosing to leave behind a situation of comfort something that you're used to. I think that you will move away from this slowly though. It will take patience and planning, but inevitably walking away from a situation that's comfortable, possibly involving, again, money in some way. There's a lot of emphasis on money and stability, investments for both the masculine and the feminine energy. So there's, um, Pluto did, is, did retrograde back into, or it is about to, ret, let's see, retrograding back into Capricorn from Aquarius for a short amount of time here. So Capricorn is very earthbound. 
So the focus will be shifting on that, very much the 3D reality and what burdens it brings. But yes, I see you, something that is just weighing you down. You might do well there. It might not be an issue necessarily in the physical sense, but it's weighing your energy down. You will, you will plan and choose to leave this behind. A lot of you feminines will be seeking to involve yourself in things that are more of personal interest to you, something that you're actually interested in, that you love, a per personal, personal. You'd be, you'd be surprised, actually. It may, you may choose this thinking, okay, well, this is really not the best financial choice, but this makes me happy. But you may be surprised to find that abundance does come from something, from choosing something that you enjoy more okay a lot of you could be there, there's some i keep hearing the word sabotage there could be some sort of sabotage that's going on possibly you could be allowing or Allowing someone to sabotage or, or you're doing this, it, it could be affecting your stability. Uh, it's a little bit blurry. That message is a little bit blurry. Or inaction, not taking action could be sabotaging you. Is what I'm picking up. Hmm. All right, show me what messages do you have for the feminine, please? Feminine energy, all zodiac signs. What's currently going on for the feminine? Lucky, you, the feminine energy is particularly more lucky at this time frame. Your consistency, being consistent will, you will be rewarded for your consistency. The universe will, that's what they're saying is the key here. Okay, what is, what's going on for feminine energy, please? There's a situation that you're dealing with here that it seems like, okay, never ending story, yang and community. Situation that you're dealing with or you're involved in that it's like, oh, I don't know. Look at, look at her. She's never ending story here. It's always the same thing, different day. You could be a little bit complacent or bored in a particular situation or dealing with a group of individuals. I don't know what this community is for you. It'll be different for everybody. But I, I, I kind of get that it just keeps repeating itself. It's, it's not necessarily bad. It's just the same thing all the time. Someone may be in this situation. They might be... A they might be noticing that you're becoming burnt out or more disconnected and they may try to, uh, you know, work on this or be more attentive. Yeah, I'm seeing also a masculine energy wanting to mend and be cooperative with you feminines. You might be kind of like, well, I, I don't know if you might think that this situation is predictable or that something hasn't changed. I feel the feminine really not being impressed by things repeating and it's like this level of boredom. But I see somebody here wanting to mend a connection with you or work together with you.
message in a bottle and deep knowing here. Let me see. Let me. What is this message in a bottle for the feminine energy? Okay. May take a long time to get back to you or there's this I'm like left on red type of deal but I feel as if like yeah you may kind of interact with interact or there's some sort of communication or message where I feel as if there isn't a response back or you could be waiting for a letter or something something just doesn't seem to be coming in for you but I feel that it will. Something is going to work out, but you might be sort of waiting a while. Like, I don't understand. You know, I'm getting issues with communication, spotty service, things just not going smoothly in regards to that. But I think that's like a temporary thing. There's a lot of tension in the planets. Mercury has... Uh, is you know has been direct it is now station direct but it does take a little bit of time for that too so there are um, issues with the internet and technology as well in the home and workplace okay but do you expect a message coming in somebody that maybe before you get a message from this person they will be on your mind you will be thinking about them And, and they will message you. It's like you both are thinking of each other here. This is a deeper knowing. I don't know who this person is, but they will. They'll come to your mind a couple days throughout, throughout the day, a couple days before they message you. So, yes. And I do feel, again, blessed here. The feminine energy is there's increased luck at this time. So I'm feeling as if a gift or potential to win, you know, a little bit more lucky. Could be feeling a little bit lonely at this time frame though in certain moments. But you may know that it's for the best with this deep knowing. I get this energy of like you know, maybe feeling lonely, but you'd rather be alone than with something that is unstable and the communication isn't, is rocky or something like that. Because I feel communication not being great coming from uh, others around you at this time frame. Or maybe in moments it is, but then it isn't, you know, so, mm, yeah. All right. Um, any other, any final message for the feminine here? Someone does not want to give up on you, feminine. I feel as if like this energy of this person, they move kind of slowly. This person may have disappointed you a time or two. I don't feel as if, but I don't feel as if they've done this on purpose. So this isn't somebody that, you know, there's a lot of drama with, but I see uh, the emperor and the prince of cups. And the Nine of Wands, Ten of Pentacles here. Somebody does not want to give up on uh, growing with you or just they see, uh, they see, they, they look at you highly. They have feelings for you, but this person, they don't show it. They may do, they may sweeten up a little bit or kind of express something about the, what's going on with them emotionally or how they're feeling in a moment coming shortly because because they 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 want to try here with this nine of wands but this is not in their nature they take on the emperor they've got something going on here but they see stability with you a lot of you there could be increased duties or possibly uh, a raising of position in some way and I, again i'm getting some sort of payout or money increase for the feminine okay so i'm just picking up sort of repeating myself now so i'm gonna let this go bye-bye